the John Frankham Maiden Chase is next in. This is two and a quarter miles. And the top one is Blackmore Instrument for Martin Leadham. Bulletproof for Daniel French. Downward spiral, Mark Jones. Flo floats like a summer fly. Joshua Southern. Tushuk Tash, Vinnie Gerard, Copycat and Ball, Alex Cherry, Faultland Task Force, Paul Rhodes, G. La High, Kevin Minahan, Kyle Rear, or T. Rogers, and locked in for James Shea. So, smallish field again. Oh, there they go. The rain coming down. Grace, guys. And Copycat Ball is in the lead. Tushuk Tash, as they come to the first. Of the fences, and over that one they go with copycat ball in the lead by about three lengths to float like a summer fly in second. Falkland's task force is third, then Tushuk Tash will take that ditch, and all over it okay with Kyle Rear, just the back mark. So copycat ball in front then from floats like a summer fly second. Falkland's task force is third, G La High is fourth, then Tushuk Tash locked in, black more instruments after that one, then downward spiral bulletproof and Kyle Rear. Is the back marker and down towards fence number three. And the copycat ball on the inside of floats like a summer fly, jumped it better and goes on into the lead from G. La High in third, and then Fulton Task Force fourth. Not quite sure what the colours are up on the top left hand corner there. Fulton Task Force. Oh, and the leader right through that. Look at that Fulton Task Force according to the graphic up the top it's got a, a luminous pink jacket on but it certainly hasn't got a luminous pink jacket on in the race it's got a white one with a green hoop and George Strawbridge colours I think when it floats like a summer fly in the lead as they come to this one in front of the stand ah he's falling anyway fault in the task force so probably got confused by having the wrong coloured jockey on and he's out of the race so past the winning post then with a circuit to go and floats like a summer fly and copycat ball are making it a tough test at the moment because they're going lickety split and they're a good eight lengths clear of G. La High in third, locked in four, Blackmore Instrument on the inside in the orange jacket. It's fifth, there's a lot of green in this race as they take the next one. And copycat ball for Alex Cherry on the outside of floats like a summer fly in second. These two are a good ten lengths clear now, I'd say, of G. La High, not quite ten, eight. Probably G. La High is third, then Bulletproof and Blackmore Instrument and Tushuk Tash. Locked in Kyle Rear and finally downward spiral as they turn. He's gone there. Another one, two have gone. Copycat ball went while up in the lead and Blackmore Instrument went all in the pack. So thrills and spills in this one then. And that's left. Floats like a summer fly. Well clear. With a loose horse in second. Tush up Tash. He's ahead of the main group. They're going to have to get cracking to catch this leader because Floats like a summer fly is well clear in the lead. From G. La High, Tushuk Tash as they take the ninth. Oh, they haven't got over that one okay. Three fours in this race, but as you've seen all the way through the day so far, but it floats like a summer fly at the tenth. Over in the lead from Tushuk Tash second, then Bulletproof third, G. La High four, then Kyle Rear, then locked in and downward spiral is the back marker and is the only one who's probably totally out of it. As they take this ditch, it's the eleventh. They're closing on the leader. And he's still six lengths clear, floats like a summer fly from Tushuk Tash, who is now being driven up to try and join that leader. Floats like a summer fly, four furlongs to go, three fences to take. Floats like a summer fly's lead down to three lengths. Tushuk Tash is second, bulletproof is now clear third, then G. La High. Then another gap back to locked in there, strung out like washing, and it floats like a summer fly over the third last in the lead from Tushuk Tash. Then bulletproof, G. La High locked in, Kyle Rear and Downward Sporrell, they're the only ones left in it, but floats like a summer fly comes down towards the second last fence with a lead of about four lengths. Tushuk Tash second. Over the second, oh, he went right through it, and so did the horse in second. And floats like a summer fly, still in the lead, but bulletproof is second. G. La High is third. Tush up Tash back in fourth, racing down towards the final fence in the John Franklin Maiden Chase. It floats like a summer fly in the lead. G. La High being driven into second. He comes up towards this final fence, looks like he's only got a jump it, stood off it, got over it okay. G. La High's trying to close, but floats like a summer fly, takes it pretty cosily in the end. Towards the line, floats like a summer fly, is it G. La High, bulletproof, locked in, car rear in dash and downward spiral on the caravana just jumping around for quite a few of those we lost three we could have lost another three i think at least but it is another winner for joshua sutherland the last season's champion i think that's three now for him him and graham clutterbuck three apiece 
Looks like a summer fly takes it. Gila High for Kevin Meenahan second. Bulletproof for Daniel French third. Locked in for James Shea fourth. And Kyle Rear for T. Rogers was having a pretty decent start in fifth. <laughs>